You're actually doing a classic Elizabethan setting for this production. I could just not see myself in a million years updating the play, so we're doing an Elizabethan production. And it's simply because what I see in the language from page to page, which is arguments about religion um, that have to do with this great shift from Catholicism to Protestant religion, and I think it's in the play from page to page, first encounter between Claudius, the new king, and Hamlet, what they say in the next few pages, we think of it as something personal, it's not. Um, one of them is reiterating a Catholic argument, Hamlet, and, um, and what Claudius has to say, it's a Protestant argument. And what the religion does to the characters mm -hmm. in the play is, you know, it informs how they view families, how they view parents, how they view sexuality, boyfriends, girlfriends. It sort of shapes and often distorts and cripples all of the relationships in the play. And I think it might be interesting for the audience to see it in that context because it's actually not done that, you know, Elizabethan productions that much. Mm -hmm. But I think uh, it puts a different spin on a lot of the arguments in the play. They are in fact uh, not just discussions between two people that seem right. personal, they're a fight for the court, for the public opinion.